so son if you're upset about it or if you're you know wondering hey how come I didn't leave you any anything substantial as inheritance It's not that I didn't love you, it's just, uh, I really don't, didn't have the, uh, they said they didn't have the acclimen, acclimen, you know, to generate a whole lot of wealth. I just didn't have the education, I didn't have the uh, know-how to generate, you know, uh, wealth and how to manage it. I wasn't, I'm not educated. That's why I'm hoping for you guys, as my ch as my offspring, to, to be better than I was, to gain all that knowledge of how to be good investors, how to take care of yourselves financially, how to take care of yourselves uh, spiritually and physically, mentally. You know, uh, I I do yeah, I have some regrets that I wasn't able to provide you guys uh, all those things that some some parents are able to do. For their kids, you know, new cars, new, uh, you know, whatever, whatever it is that uh, they want or desire. I wasn't able to meet all those expectations, if, if there were any, for that, you know. But at least you're making a contribution more than just a bare minimum, as, as was the complaint, you know. Uh, making the bare minimum of child support, you know, under court order. But I believe I gave more than that. I mean, I would, uh, your mom would ask for, for a little extra here and there, and I would give it when I had, when I had it. But sometimes I didn't have it, so I couldn't give it. And I would give uh, maybe a, a smaller amount than what was requested. But I still tried to help out, you know, even though it may not have been significant. But uh, I'm hoping that uh, you guys will be able to manage it on your own, you know, uh, survive, get those skills of survival. And if you want to, if you want to have a more of a comfortable lifestyle, you have to work for it. You have to go to school for it. You have to either vocational school or college or, or classes, you know, uh, towards that particular career, towards that particular goal. You have to train for it, you have to study for it, you have to learn for it, and you have to be a wise money manager. You have to manage your resources wisely and sparingly and, and uh, responsibly, you know? So I know I struggled in those things. I was just uh, kind of, everything was a game and everything was for play and I didn't really take a whole lot seriously as a uh, as a teenager in my younger years. So you know, I'm hoping that you guys will take life, you know, have fun, enjoy life, but also take a little more seriously. Prepare, plan, strategize, build a portfolio, a portfolio for your investments, for your uh, uh, what other your resumes, for your credentials. That all that all counts. That's what that's what uh, being a responsible citizen is, and you have to constantly. If you improve society around, you're making a contribution towards uh, society when you make personal improvements. You can be a better asset to the community, and you, you don't have to be a liability. You can be an asset, a contributor.